What's up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and today I want to talk to you guys about the key rate for Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, and if you guys have been playing the game recently, then you know that we just got off a double key weekend, pretty much, even though it lasted a lot longer than a weekend, but uh, it still was a lot of fun, I did have a lot of fun, I grinded about 1,000 keys, and I do have a lot of salvage saved up also, so I had a lot of fun that week, and a lot of people are arguing that the key rate should be increased for Infinite Warfare, so I want to ask that question to you guys, because I for one do kind of agree that the the key rate for Infinite Warfare and also Black Ops 3 is extremely low so I kind of feel that the key rate should be increased by a little bit so uh, I want you guys to tell me your thoughts about this in the comment section down below but for Black Ops 3 and Infinite Warfare the key rate is pretty much the exact same if not completely identical it takes about 10 games of domination to earn one rare supply drop that could possibly give you a terrible drop so maybe like two commons and a rare or uh, maybe just one rare and then you'll get a camo or possibly a attachment variant if we're talking about Black Ops 3 here or like I said for Infinite Warfare maybe a camo, a reticle, a charm for your gun, your rigs there's a lot of stuff that you can get for Infinite Warfare that you probably don't want in the game but getting all those types of content in your supply drop isn't all that bad because then it'll fill up your slots and then when IW comes out with a do protected bundle or a bribe for Black Ops 3 then you're gonna get something that you don't have however these do protected deals only come out once in a while now keep in mind that IW has hundreds of different loot items plus a key rate currently that will only give you 30 keys for about 10 games of domination that uh, lasts a pretty long time a little bit over 10 minutes to be exact personally I think that's a little absurd and I wouldn't doubt it if IW hired psychologists and maybe some gambling experts to come up with this key rate that will you know still motivate players to play the game but at the same time consider the idea of buying cod points to make the process of getting a rare drop a lot faster and then maybe you're gonna pull an epic weapon from your drop which will warrant you to want to purchase more COD points and spend more money, thus uh, kind of stimulating the mind, if you will, that uh, action reward kind of deal for psychology. I did take a psychology class in college, and we actually had a very good discussion about gambling and why people get addicted to it so much, and the reason why is because of that action reward system, but the thing is for Call of Duty and also for Infant Warfare in this case, it's not technically gambling since you are putting something in and you're getting something in return, so it's not really gambling, and we also have a second way of of earning a weapon that we want from uh, the salvage system. I really do like that system a lot. I feel that the salvage system is also kind of low too, personally. But uh, the point is, we still have another way to earn weapons that we want. Uh, but I don't know, guys. I, that's just my thoughts. I do feel that Infant Warfare has the second best system. The first one is MWR, and then Black Ops 3 is the last system. So I don't know. That's just how I feel, guys. I want to know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I did like Advanced Warfare system, actually, because I remember, like, I used to get supply jumps every other game, if not every game. And uh, obviously, we got 10. Uh, every 10 games, we would get a advanced supply job giving us a pretty good deal. Or we could also get a weapon that we want every time we prestige. So, Advanced Warfare had a pretty good system, but we're talking about a key rate here. So, I'm only going to include Infinite Warfare, Black Ops 3, and MWR. So, tell me your thoughts in the comment section down below, guys. Also, drop a like if you guys enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. I'm a very tough rest of the day, and I'll see you guys later.